Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how I dyed this wig and how I installed it. Um, as you can see, the hair has like three different colors in it. So I decided I wanted to add a little bit more color to it. I am using the Adore Dye in Cinnamon and Cajun Spice. I only use one bottle of each. I kind of wish I would have had two bottles of cinnamon instead of um, Cinnamon and Cajun Spice. Because I just feel like the Cajun Spice was a little too orange. But then at the same time... I feel like it wasn't orange enough whenever I was done with the hair. So maybe I should have used two cinnamon and two Cajun spice. Or maybe one cinnamon and two Cajun spice. I'm not sure, but I would like to try to recreate this look on a blonde wig. Maybe that would come out better since it would be like a blank canvas instead of starting on hair that's already dyed. But anyways, that's besides the point. Um, so I'm just like submerging the hair into the water, making sure that it's getting every strand. And as you can see, it had soaked up most of the dye and then that's when I was like, I should have bought more dye. So I'm adding the rest of the cinnamon and I believe I'll add a little bit more of the Cajun spice towards the end. I don't know if I showed that or not, but I did. I just used both, like all of the, all of the dye out of both bottles. I just used it all. And then I probably let the wig sit for like an hour max. So now you can see that the wig is done being dyed. This is the finished product. And you can see there's like different like colors in it. That's because the hair was already like three different colors before I dyed it. So the dye like picked up differently on the hair. I mean, I don't mind it. I kind of like it because it gives the hair dimension, but you know, it's whatever. So now I'm just hot combing the hairline back. And I'm going to pluck the smallest amount just in the front because of um, how the hairline was shaped I didn't want it to come forward so I just plucked that little middle part back and I am creating a side part right I never do a side part so I was really excited for this because I just knew this week was gonna look amazing with a side part and I was right so yeah I'm just gonna continue hot combing it and then um, I'm gonna plug it and then you guys are gonna see me install the wig and the rest is pretty much self-explanatory. Um, I'm going to style it on camera. And then I'm going to come back towards the end and talk to you guys. I'm going to have all the hair details down below for you guys. I don't know if I mentioned it or not, but this hair is from Nadula Hair. So all details will be down below. I'm not really sure of the length and density. But I really did enjoy this wig. And I did sell it. I'm kind of sad that I sold it because I really, really liked it. I didn't think that I would like ginger orange hair on me. But it's really pretty. And it's perfect for the fall. Like, I feel like every black girl needs a ginger wig for the fall. Because ginger hair just looks amazing on us. Like, why am I just not realizing that? But, yeah, I'm talking too much. So, I'm installing the wig now. Self-explanatory. You guys know how to install a wig. If you don't, watch this part and you will see how to install a wig. But, yes, I will talk to you guys again in, like, real time. Like, actually talking on camera towards the end of the video so you guys make sure you're subscribed if you're not like this video give it a thumbs up if you like it give it a thumbs down if you don't like it it doesn't matter just interact <laughs> but i will talk to you guys later on and yeah thanks for watching guys
So this is the completed look you guys. I love this hair like I never thought that I would like ginger hair 
but I'm loving this. I don't know if you can tell, but it is kind of lighter up here and then more orange towards the bottom. I don't know why that happened. Already pretty light before I dyed it. That's why I did dye it because I was like, there's too many different colors in this wig, so I wanted to dye it this color that i just didn't really take to the top but it's okay because i actually really like it still like even though it's a little lighter up here still kind of feeling it because i like how it matches my skin tone more but this is so pretty i'm so happy that i decided to just go ahead and dye it because i feel like if i would have put it on without trying to fix it i would have hated it but i love it now and i low-key want to keep this way just like such a fall look and it's so pretty like I feel so pretty like I haven't had a wig that just made me feel like so pretty in like a long time I'm not sure of all the hair details like the length and density but that will all be in the description box below for you guys you guys enjoyed seeing me dye the wig so I did not really pluck it that much I really only plucked like right here did not pluck the sides I believe it's pre-plucked so I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video I'm gonna have all the hair details down below for you guys thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you're not already and I'll see you guys next time bye guys Thank you.